is day five of the sturgeon spearing season and the lake is going fast. A lot of water, a lot of wind. Uh, everybody's pulling shacks like crazy. Almost every shack they check, pull in the wets here that uh, they were falling in the holes already. Wind blew them off the holes and a lot of them were tipped in. I got one shack out here on runners in the middle of the lake that me and Moose, my cousin Scott from the marina, are headed out to get it in. Hopefully it's still up. Uh, it's not too bad here on off of shore. Layer ice now, everything in snow is all gone, water on the ice. But uh, I've been seeing tons of pictures and videos on Facebook. Jack's going down and water running down the launches. It just be careful out there. Um, everything should tighten back up, but now you can't see the sturgeon holes anymore. The lats all fell down. Uh, hopefully, we can get this out. Crap, I was getting nervous. Like, if you did, I've had to do it in the past. Yeah. Oh, he saved the number, <laughs> otherwise, it was gonna be a reef. <laughs> There's the cake right there. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, I was maybe nervous. I thought I was gonna, because all I had to do was probably not go and then go yeah, back. That's why I said we were better off to snatch it. Yeah. There's the water mark right there. That's how much of the number was underwater. She's still alive though. My oldest shack in our fleet I've had since 96 or something. It was on wheels at one point. 
fix that twice. Finally put it back on, it on runners because it was just falling apart. It's our lucky shack. Very lucky today. That serves me right, it's my own fault. We were out here yesterday, it was beautiful. Started to get windy, rainy. Should have known better that I should have pulled it off. Any water in that ice just makes it, just eats away at it and it just proof. There's tons of them today they were pulling off that were like this um, in the hole or just about to be. So we got it out, thanks to the savior. So we're gonna pull it into it. dry the number is safe and sound old girl made it up there is still a lot of ice out there it's just the these holes are opening up the water on the ice is making it worse so it's not like it was as dangerous as it looked when we were out there there's still we haven't really lost ice I don't think because Scott was checking it earlier today when they're pulling them in there's still good ice but it's deteriorating fast I guess with the water on it swirling in the holes that's the problem so it's the first time I ever almost lost a shack, ever. So I've learned something from the, they'll never uh, take any chances, I guess, if there's any water or rain coming. Get your shack off, or at least get them up the holes. There's still shacks up there, not on the holes, just sitting, and they're fine. It's just when it stay on the holes, so. You live and learn, I guess. I got lucky on that one.